Welcome back to Real VR Fishing. We're playing the Quest Native Edition, and we're playing on a Meta Quest 2. Before we get started, take a minute to click the S in the corner to subscribe. Heading for 10,000 subscribers, it would be fantastic if you were one of them. Also, like, share, leave a comment. Let me know what you think of the video, or the game, or any tips or tricks you have for Real VR Fishing. Let's get to it. We're going to continue our play of the U.S. West DLC. I'd like to continue my uh, saltwater adventures. But uh, we've been to all the locations. So we're going to do some repeats. Which I think is uh, Big Sur Coast. We didn't spend a lot of time on. So let's head there and see what we can catch. sit down in my boat here what do we have spinner a and we've got casting rod a and casting reel a and uh, expert mode with line color My viewers mentioned I should try jerking the bait like I just did there, and it uh, worked out that time. Seems like a smaller fish. Thanks to uh, some of my own research and some viewer comments, I've eased up on my reeling while the fish are running and frolicking and letting it go into the the blue just a just a touch which seems to put them in the green more often so it's been working well for us so far start off with the uh, bait that attracts smaller fish and see if we can get maybe a shark Take the smaller fish. All right, another small fish. They're just letting off a bit when they splash around. Give them some leeway. Tire themselves out. California scorpion fish. Yeah, I think I've seen one of those before. Where to next? I'm not seeing any indications. So, oh, there's something out there. Oh, that was not the right direction. Let's pull that back. That's better. That seems like it's on the surface, whatever it is but it's moving away from our from our bait. So let's let the bait drop. There's another distortion right there. Let's pull this in and try to target this one in front of us. That did not do it. I'm kind of experimenting with my uh, casting aim to see if I can get more precise. So it's uh, doing some wacky things sometimes as I experiment with uh, my controller direction, basically. Oh, that's coming over now. I like this uh, flick. And uh, hey, check it out. I don't think we're attracting that fellow though with with this bait, so let's change it up. Let's 
go with the, the spoon. Ah, it seems to want to go to the left there. But let's see if we can flick it over some. I've got to be careful not to flick it back. Flick and then move back slowly. Oh, that was pretty good. We got something interested. Oh, a little frolicking, but uh, blue line, so I don't think it's too big, whatever it is. Maybe we'll get a jump. Snap, we got a green line. Green means go. Now, I've got it on single-handed, so I can't reel like crazy. California Corbina. Yeah, we've seen all these cats before. Okay, don't think that was a large one. Let's go to our bait screen here. And, uh, we try the minnow? Let's try the spoon A. Check for any indications. We haven't done a lot over here. Find the first cast after switching bait is sometimes a bit flaky. So my flow now is to, you know, when the fish initially runs after you set the hook, obviously you, you don't reel then. As soon as it stops running, start reeling. When it starts to go side to side, I stop reeling, but I start reeling when I think it's nearing the end of its run. And then if it's running back and forth, I just stop altogether. And I stop as soon as I see light red. I used to kind of reel into the red. I've stopped doing that. And of course, when the fish jumps, try to flick your rod in the opposite direction. Now make sure it's the opposite direction or uh, you're not gonna get the snap. So take the time. I was kind of doing it on reflex, and uh, if you get the wrong direction initially, then it ends up failing. And you're not going to lose the fish every time. If you miss the snap, but um, it's not good. And the harder fish, uh, you want to get all those snaps. Let's go back out there. There's something way out there. I might try standing up and casting to see if I can get that, uh, that one way in the distance. I'm not sure. You would think that shouldn't make a difference for the game, whether you're sitting or standing, but you never know. Realistically, you should be able to cast further. If you're standing. Hmm. Getting a lot of small fish. As soon it runs, I don't just reel through it, I kinda let up. Give it some slack. This feels exactly like the last fish. One of the Corbinas or is it kelp bass? Oh, yellowfin croaker. Caught a lot of those too. Not 
not seeing anything too interesting. Let's switch back to the spinner. And go straight out this time. Oh, we're going to cross something. That looks like surface. Let's see if we can catch its eye. Oh, it's moving away. Oh, coming back a bit, but I don't think it's our bait that's uh, doing that. Well, something's interested. Something with a bit of run in it. Okay. Not too much of a run. That's one. Going the other way is two. I'm letting off. Letting off some more. May get a jump here. Looks like it could be a small shark. Letting off. Oh, we're into the blue. Danger, danger. Okay. Letting off. It's just a narrow little gap between red and blue on this fish. But coming in slowly. Easy does it. Gotcha. Barracuda. All right. I like barracudas. We got no targets, so just tossing it in. I like to let it sink to the bottom. You feel a little vibration when it hits the bottom, and you can kind of bounce it along the bottom. Uh, and then bring it back up to the surface. Kind of see if there's any fish throughout the depth. But it's like we're not getting anything out of that cast. So uh, let's go straight out this way. down to the watery deep. There, let's hit the bottom. But nothing there.
rare, eh? California sheephead. You got a sheephead? Well, look at you. No, nothing here either. Let's pull that in, try the soft bait. Sinks the slowest, so give it a little more time. Something curious. A little sniff. It's got a bit of strength. I see a fin. Maybe a leopard shark. So I let off just then. Now we'll reel and let off. Okay, let off while he's running. Oh, too much, too much. Catch up. Might get a jump here. Oh, other way. Nope. Oh, what is that? That's one big fish. But we didn't get the snap, which is a bit dangerous. Okay. We're going to get another jump. One more run. Yeah. Oh, 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 you go. Okay, now we'll get a snap or a jump. Nope. You go. Take your time. Other way. Oh, not too much time. No, now we're going to lose him. Ay, ay, ay. Nope. Still got a chance. Didn't get the snap again. I went the wrong way initially. We need those snaps. Easy. Okay, going that way. That's fine. We're getting a lot of these. Oh, no. Not good. Another reprieve, though. We gotta do better with the jumps. Okay. Ooh, we got the snap that time. Okay. Got some green. We let him run a bit. He's taking a break. Where are you going to go? That way. Okay. Going to get another jump. Got another snap. Give him some line to play with. Tire himself out. Or her. Not too much, not too much. Oh. Back and forth. Okay. Gonna get another jump here. We got the snap that time. Here we go. Jump? No, other way. Jump after this one, maybe. We got that snap. We got some green. Slow 
going steady. Keep the system. Gonna get a jump here. We got that snap too. Thankfully, it was close. I did a half start in the wrong direction. Oh, too blue, too blue. Okay. Let him go a bit. Catch it on the blue. There we go. Catch it on the blue. Got some green. We're getting close. Knock on wood. Lots of wood on the boat to knock on. No, no, no. Don't do this to me. We got the snap. Bring him in. Nice and gentle now. Oh yeah, come to daddy. Yellowfin tuna. There's a big fish. Just taking it in. All right. 542 pounds. Only 427 credits though. Well, I think we'll end on this fella. This is the Big Sur Coast in real VR fishing. We're playing the Quest Native version on a MetaQuest 2. If you haven't already, take a minute to click the S in the corner to subscribe. Heading for 10,000 subscribers. Be fantastic if you were one of them. Also, like, share, leave a comment. Let me know what you think of the video or the game or any tips or tricks you have for real VR fishing. Thanks for watching and we'll catch you next time.